Hi guys, welcome to my fingerstyle guitar tutorial of Supermarket Flowers by Ed Sheeran. And in this tutorial we're going to run the intro, verse and the pre-chorus of the song. And we're going to tune all of our strings down a half step. And to do this I'm using an app on my phone, you can also use a regular tuner. So start with a 6th string and tune it to a D sharp. Tune a 5th string to a G sharp. Tune a 4th string to a C sharp. 3rd string to F sharp, 2nd string to A sharp, and 1st string to D sharp. Okay? And I also put an Amazon affiliate link in my description for all the equipment and some stuff that I recommend because a lot of you have been asking for this. And what we're going to learn in this tutorial is going to sound like this. So we're going to start by learning the intro of the song. So that's bar 1 to 4. And for bar number 1, put your middle finger on the 3rd fret 6th string, ring finger on the 3rd fret 2nd string, and pink finger on the 3rd fret 1st string. And now we have a G major chord. And we're going to do a finger roll with the right hand on string 6, 3, 2, 1. So we're basically going to roll the strings, very quickly, kind of like a strum with our fingers. And now we're going to change to a B minor chord. So start by putting your point finger on the 2nd fret 5th string, and now you're going to bar all the strings under the 5th string. Then add your ring finger to the 4th fret 4th string, pink finger to the 4th fret 3rd string, and middle finger to the 3rd fret 2nd string. And we're going to do the finger roll on string 5, 3, 2, 1. And if you don't like to use the bar chord, you can also put a point finger on the 2nd fret 1st string, middle finger on the 3rd fret 2nd string, and ring finger on the 4th fret 3rd string. And only do the roll on the last 3 strings. Okay, so we have... And for the next bar, we're going to have a C major chord. So put your ring finger on the 3rd fret 5th string and put your point finger on the 1st fret 2nd string. And we're going to do the finger roll on string 5, 3, 2, 1. So now we have... And for bar number 3, we're going to have the same G chord. And the plucking pattern is going to be different here. So we're going to pluck string 6, 3, then 2 and 1 together, back to 3. So we have, then change to the B minor chord, and pluck string 5, 3, 2 and 1 together, and 3. So we have, and for the last bar, bar number 4, back on the C major chord, and now we want to pluck string 5, 3, 2, 1 at the same time. So we're not going to do a finger roll here. And we're going to end this bar by playing open 3rd string and do hammer on to the 2nd fret 1st string. Okay, so now we know bar 1 to 4. Okay, so now we're going to learn the verse of the song and we're going to start with bar 5 to 8. So the intro ended with a... So we're going to continue from here. 
So for bar number five, put your ring finger on the third fret sixth string. And with your right hand, you're going to pluck string six and two at the same time. Then pluck string two, two more times quickly. And then pluck it one more time. So have. Then put your point finger on the second fret, fifth string. Middle finger on the second fret, third string. And we're going to play string five and three at the same time. Play the third string again. And play it one more time and do a slide to the fourth fret and then back to the second. Okay, like. Okay. So for bar five. And now for bar number six, keep only your middle finger on the second fret third string and add your ring finger to the third fret fifth string. And now you're going to pluck string five and three at the same time and do a pull off to open on the third string. And then play the third string again. And we're going to end this bar. We're playing an open third string and do a hammer on to the second fret. So we have. And for bar number seven, we have, it's almost the same as bar five but we're going to have a ring finger on the 3rd fret 6th string and we're going to play string 6 and 2 at the same time play it 2 more times and then 1 more time so and then put your point finger on the 2nd fret 5th string middle finger on the 2nd fret 3rd string and play them at the same time then play the 3rd string again and now play the 3rd string again 2nd fret and do a pull off to open now play open. And we're going to end these four bars with bar eight. So we're only going to play one time on the fifth string, third fret. So bar number five to eight. And now we're going to learn bar nine to twelve. And for bar number nine, put your point finger on the first fret second string, and we're going to start this bar with playing sixth string alone. And then we're going to do a finger roll on string four, three, two. And do a hammer on to the third fret second string. So we have. And then play the second, sorry, third fret second string one more time. Lift your fingers and play the second string open. We have so far. And now play string four and two at the same time and do a hammer on to the first string. And play open second string. Middle finger on the second fret third string. And then play open third string. So bar number nine. One more time. Bar number 10, put your ring finger on the 3rd fret 5th string and with your right hand you're going to play string 5 and 3 at the same time. Play string 3 again. Play the 2nd string open. And then put your ring finger on the 3rd fret 6th string and play string 6 and 2 at the same time. And then play the 6th string alone. So we have... And now play... 3rd string open and do a hammer on to the 2nd. So bar number 10. And for bar number 11, put your ring finger on the 3rd fret 5th string. And now we're going to pluck string 5 and 2 at the same time. Put your point finger on the 1st fret 2nd string and do a pull off to open. Put your middle finger on the 2nd fret 3rd string and play string 4 and 3 at the same time. And now you're going to play the 3rd string, 2nd fret and do a really quick pull off to open. And play open string again. And open 3rd string again. So we have... And now for bar number 12, put your ring finger on the 3rd fret 6th string. And play it once. And then we're going to wait for a while and then we're going to play open 3rd string. And do a hammer on to the 2nd. After we learn bar 12, we're going to repeat the verse one more time 
Um, and this time we're going to end on bar 20. We're going to play the sixth string, the third fret, and we're going to end this bar with just a slap instead of playing. Okay, and now we're going to start with the pre-chorus. Okay, so now we're going to learn the pre-chorus and we're going to learn bar 21 to 24. So start by playing the fifth string. And now put your pink finger on the third fret second string and we're going to pluck string three, two, one at the same time. And then do a slide to the fifth fret on the second string. So uh, keep holding your pink finger on the fifth fret and now we're going to slap the strings. And at the same time, we're going to strum string two and one with your ring finger of your right hand. And now put your pink finger on the second fret first string, play it once, move it to the third and play it once. And then add your ring finger to the third fret fifth string, play it once, and then play open third string. So we have. And now add your middle finger to the second fret fourth string, because now we're going to slap the strings and at the same time you're going to hit string 4 and 3. So you're going to strum the strings with your middle finger. And then put your ring finger on the 3rd fret 6th string and now you're going to pluck string 6 and 2 at the same time. So that's bar 21. And for bar 22. You're going to play open third string and then we're going to slap the strings and at the same time you're going to use your middle finger of your right hand to strum the third string open and then put your point finger on the second fret third string and play string four and three at the same time so uh, and then we're going to play the third string again and do a quick pull off to open and then we're going to hammer on on the 4th fret, so just the hammer on, you're not going to use your right hand. And very quickly after the hammer on, slap the strings and then play open 3rd string. So, one more time. Quickly. Okay, so now for the next bar, we actually already know this one because it's the same as 21, so bar 23. But bar 24 is different from 22. So put your point finger on the first fret, second string, play it once, and then you're going to slap the strings and strum string 3 and 2 at the same time. You use your ring finger of your right hand for this. And now put your middle finger on the 2nd fret 3rd string and play string 4 and 3 at the same time. And now we're going to have the same as bar 22. So play the 3rd string, 2nd fret and do a quick pull off to open. And then do the hammer on to the 4th. Slap the strings and play open. So bar 24. Okay, so bar 21 to 24 is going to sound like... Okay, so this was all for the first part of my Finistar guitar tutorial of Supermarket Flowers by Ed Sheeran. And if you like this tutorial, go subscribe to my channel and also I have free tabs uh, for downloading my video description. So have a great day guys.